I don't know what to make of Bears knowing how to play hockey. Exactly. <laughs> Bears playing hockey. I did uh, tweet the link if you want to play along at home. Uh, uh, Chip's sister, what's up? Oh. Uh, are, are they playing hockey barefooted? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for calling. He's good. You want some Megadeth? Yeah, let's hear Megadeth. Yeah, yeah. Have, have fun. Uh, brother will kill brother, spilling blood across the land, killing for religion, something I don't understand. All right, that that's, makes sense. That's already 400% more intelligent than anything <laughs> Little Wayne has ever said. At least I understand it. All right, well, we'll take Danny, the Megadeth expert, taking, he gets to pick the Megadeth lines and the Little Wayne lines. Ah, it's not, uh, Sam, Sam's point Show is, me some intelligent find, little, little Wayne find songs. Find a little Wayne line. That's fair enough. Yeah, but you, I'm not, got, you got chances, I'm not saying Sam. Dave Mustaine is like, you know, the, the, the lyricist of our generation. <laughs> prophet. But, uh, you know. I want to say in cultural context, if you brought this. Who's culture? If you brought this set yeah. of lyrics to the hip-hop culture, they would look at you like, what does that even nah, mean? Nah, they would like yeah, that. because they can't they, read it. They would. They, <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh damn, Hold it yo. upside down. <laughs> oh, no, you did. They're flipping pages with their feet. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh Danny. Something is secure. Now, that, one, that one I think they would like. That one they would like. Yeah, because it's about killing and, you know, it's pretty self-explanatory. There are plenty yes. of metal lyrics they probably wouldn't like. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. You know, <laughs> Screwdriver, I don't think they'd like that band. <laughs> no. Yeah. Oh, what? I used to be a rapper. Yeah? I would rap. My name was Saran. <laughs> oh, oh, Saran. <laughs> Doesn't even really make sense. Saran sure, rapper. Sa uh, Saran rapper. <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Holy shit. I, I just cannot even deal. <laughs> And by the way, it isn't a coincidence. I mean, let's play both sides of this. E-Trade e e knew exactly what they were doing. Yeah, of course they, they were mocking <laughs> Lindsay Lohan. Come on. But, but if, there's no way they're going to be able to, you know, prove it. Yeah. Sure, just don't behave like a drunk. Don't don't make such a fucking spectacle out of yourself. If, yes. you don't want, if you don't want your first name to be synonymous with embarrassing behavior, then don't act that way. She fell into the eyeglass machine and made a spectacle of herself. It's not bad, actually. I, my, my head almost concaved in when you said that. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing lens jokes. <laughs> yeah. I went to lens uh, crafters recently. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What happened? So could you craft me some lenses? Let's think get out of here. Let's go to Greg in D.C. <laughs> Louis, are we promoting Carolines or what? Is yeah, that the I'm deal? this weekend. Oh, fuck. Sell you it out. Don't even need damn, you don't promoting. Need Just stop it now, Louis. Stop being Sunday, silly. <laughs> Sunday morning. Sunday the first show. No, morning. Sunday the first show is a benefit for my kids' school, so the tickets are a little more. Oh. Wait. Uh-oh, so uh -oh, Kenny. You hear this? Wow, Louis doing a lot of fucking shows. Louis is doing a uh, famous guy amount of shows. Famous guy amount. <laughs> yeah. Louis is Louis doing Thursday night, 7.30 and 10.00. Friday, 7.30 and 10. I think we're adding one Friday. Oh, good. Happy Holy for you. Holy shit. <laughs> Saturday. <laughs> Happy for you. Oh, thank you. Saturday, 7.30, 10 and midnight. And then Sunday, 7 and 9.30. So Louis is doing 10 shows. Yeah, seven... He's doing three shows Friday and three shows Saturday. Yeah, that's yeah. what happens wow. when people do. do... <laughs> the only other... This just guy changed... didn't need more shows. He'd be just he'd be up doing Tuesdays. <laughs> change the name of the place to <laughs> Louis C.K. Lines. <laughs> yeah. They're pretty good. I love it. I love photography and stuff. Yeah. I love the, well, ma making movies is one of my favorite things ever. And, you introduced uh, everybody uh, on this very program to the flip. Wait, which, he was uh, the first flip guy. Cam. Yes, that's right. He was the first guy that came in here and goes, no "Check this out." And I yes. was like, "I went out that day and bought one." Mm -hmm. And then they came out with the uh, HD flip. Mm -hmm. Like we all have them, a, a week later, they came out with the HD <laughs> flip. So I bought that flips. one. I got like four now. Yeah, I, I, yeah, just I have keep, them kind of laying around the house. I got them like all over the place. Yeah. yeah, you gotta leave them all over just in case something happens. You yeah. have one. Exactly. They're yeah. they're actually excellent because of the of, I'm doing an ad for them, but you know because of that SD, you know the fact that you can plug them in the computer. Yeah, plug so them right don't in. Need batteries. That's a big thing. Yeah. Yep. The battery stinks in the two hour one too. It always shows that it's running out. Yeah, and then they came out with a new one that takes batteries. Fucking idiots. Wow. Fuck yeah. flip. Hope they, they fucking hope, <laughs> hope they go down. Yes, no. I hope they hope they flip. Oh, oh, might have oh, fallen oh, on their backs oh, or something. Shit. I'll no. tell you when I got my last flip, I did not flip. <laughs> That's a good one. Uh.
that uh, the whale died of natural causes. They're, they're, and no, stuff, they were trying to it, figure out why it died. Oh, oh. But when it got into the intestines that are as big as fucking, uh, help me out with a reference here. Uh, I don't know. I don't know just mm. massive intestines. She's she's like cunning. Big sewer pipes. Yeah, basically mm. sewer pipes that 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 are uh, whatever. Little kitten or boy come out. <laughs> she was cutting into them, and the fucking she couldn't find anything inside. So she's like, well, it was probably not eating uh, near the end of its life, so it was probably sick. It was hungry. But if anyone Poor else guy. saw the show, so I could help uh, describe this to Anthony and Jimmy. Stop cutting me. <laughs> <laughs> What a, what and an, it starts. <laughs> what an unbelievable show, though, man. Unbelievable. <laughs> Our intestines. The only good reference for big intestines look like the, the whale had a whole bunch of cupcakes in there. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, it's big. All right, well, let's do the Delta flight thing. Um, this is what happened to one of the fine passengers. A group of Delta passengers had a great time in Puerto Rico until they got home to Colorado. Everything was thoroughly soaked and heavy with jet fuel. Overwhelmed by the smell. Fuck, I want to stop it there and just say calm and everyone would have laughed and oh well. I still think it's funny. You think it's funny? Wait, dude, I got got a joke for you. (laughs) Good luck doing that without Ant. Okay. No, that's okay. It's the people, he don't even like it. It's the people outside that do. Hit the, hit the, watch this. And heavy with ja- cappuccinos. <laughs> what? Smell like cappuccinos. Oh. Everybody's all caffeinated, fighting and stuff. <laughs> Number one and two on iTunes, huh? Yeah, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's the best comedy CDs that do impersonations. Until they got home to Colorado, <laughs> everything was thoroughly soaked and calm. That would have been a, at least a, a quick laugh for people out there. I would say something not with that kind of language, probably like maybe coffee yes. with, some, with some Caesar salad dressing, you know, because everybody likes it. It's <laughs> cracking a bit. I'm supposed to encourage him. Sorry. Chico, the until they hit. got home to Colorado. <laughs> Everything was thoroughly <laughs> soaked and heavy with jet fuel. And we're in the middle of uh, a Delta passenger. Yeah. Got their luggage. Oh, it was only one passenger. No, no, no. It was every passenger. It was. A lot of passengers. The whole plane. Okay. Uh, and they got their luggage, and it's uh, 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 jet fuel. Just soaked in jet fuel. <laughs> <laughs> You think the baggage handlers in Puerto Rico just are just fucking <laughs> squirting down the luggage with <laughs> jet fuel? And the people who uh, you have to complain and demand that those scumbags at the airline give you what they owe you. Yeah. The airlines are scumbags, man. They only respond to, uh, to, to being dealt with harshly, which is like, you know, again, having a platform like Kevin does, like, you know, we do on a, you yeah, know, yeah. it helps a lot. Because you can at least tell people your shitty experience with them. But if you're the average Joe. Dude, I feel bad for people because I know that in a worst case scenario, I tell a guy, and I've told guys this, I want you to remember this conversation. Yeah. Because your phone is going to ring and I want you to remember. Yes. I'm telling you, you don't want that. I mean, I really am I'm a dick about it, but it's like tr- try to give them a fair shot. And if they don't do the right thing. People like to jump on them because everybody gets fucked by these companies. You Everyone know, has to deal with these scumbags. The airlines are really bad because uh, there's no choice. What are you going to take a Conestoga wagon to uh, California for three months? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, you got to get yourself a bunch of birds and string together a sheet and make them carry it. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Thanks. Wasn't doing too good when you weren't in here. Everybody's not as big a fan. <laughs> so I'm glad you're back to encourage it, Ed. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I knew the bit was missing something. <laughs> you may not know this, but there are actually people out there who don't enjoy Chip Chipperson. Oh, my oh, God. Boy. No way. I don't see how. <laughs> how about we start with the people in the studio? Oh, come on. We all love Chip. He's the proverbial smash hit. Everybody <laughs> says it. All That's right. why that guy punched the black guy, because he didn't like Chip on the bus. All right, Mary. <laughs> I want to go to jail for a year. Why? Let's get fucking ass. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs>